Welcome to Elden Ring, the number one rated game, rated 10 out of 10 by almost every, every video game review company out there. Also, if I'm not mistaken, which I do not think I'll be willing to put money on it, I'm not, Orion's first Souls-type game. You should have put money on it. You would have won. Oh boy, it's been a while since I've said this like this. Hey everyone, I'm Orion the Starhog, and welcome to Elden Ring. I know I made it public on Twitter I wasn't going to do this. Don't ask me how we got here. I don't know, but we're here. <laughs> so, I'm going to go through this. I'm almost entirely blind. The only thing I know is the subsequent memes showing up, thanks to Megamind. And one of the hardest bosses in the game, thanks to my guests over here. I want my dog back. <laughs> so... I have not even so much as booted into this. Like, as soon as I push this button, is it going to make me do it again? Yep, there it goes again. With the there whole you ULA, this and that. No, I, no, like, no, that's, no. That, that's that, how that, that fresh. Welcome screen, that yeah. welcome screen will happen every time you boot up the game. You won't have to do the EULA, but that welcome to Elden Ring will happen. Please adjust the brightness. Uh, honestly, I'm fine where it is. Y axis. No! We are not doing airplane controls. Not on your life. Oh, so here's the. The class selection. He he went over a baseline of a lot of this stuff, like what the classes are, what they do, yada yada. Hit, um, uh, hit triangle to show attributes. Ah. Oh, they all start at different levels. So Vagabond is like your mid to easy mode in terms of start off. There is no mid to easy mode. Okay, but I'm, t I'm talking in terms of overall level done. Not necessarily. I mean, if you go over to Wretch, right, you'll see something very interesting. All They're of its all... stats are 10, but it's level 1. I take it that's because that's the most customizable, you said. Yeah. My character on my current playthrough is started as a wretch, and I'm on New Game 3, so... this you're, you're done, You've done it three times now. Yeah. Now you know why I brought this man. Alright, well... Based on what I have been told... The class I am currently on, the Vagabonds, are your hulking behemoths. Now, if you saw my Twitter, you know I have something of an archetype with how I like to play my games. A is male, B is female. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, I actually get to use my keyboard? Yeah. Body type A, age... I'm young. Thank you. I'm only 24 at this point. Thank you very or much. Origin determines, like, uh, the race of your person. Uh... What's the closest thing to just base human? Yes, I'm that boring. Actually, no, you're Vagabond. Hold on. Yeah, no, we can... Keepsake is something very important. There's a lot of options. A golden seed will allow you to increase your flask. Crimson Amber Medallion is the item that will allow you to... Fanged Imp Ashes is a fairly good summon. They inflict bleed cramp. Actually, oh, so yeah, this, you know is, this is your starting charm, then? Yeah, what you want to start with. It's not a charm, but it allows you to bring one thing with you into the world by default. Uh, then honestly, again, since I'm going Behemoth, I'd go with the Crimson Amber. Now you can go and choose your base template and your detailed appearance. Oh, wait a minute. This is a speed level up, though, isn't it? That is one-time use, though. Crimson Amber. Ah! Oh, my God. Is it actually going to make me go through all of it? Okay, we're going to speed this up because this is going to take a minute. Hold on, I just want to, I just want to <laughs> mess around with this. <laughs> oh, I won't let you! You mean I can't run around with the bobblehead? No. <laughs> Leave this in. <laughs> Fr frick the you bo guys! Bobblehead complaints. <laughs> <laughs> bobblehead complaints. Seriously. Okay, here we go. Time to die. Oh, how bad am I about to get murked? Uh, besides the one where I'm guaranteed to get murked. That's how far I've gone into this. You only know that you will die your first boss. <laughs> mm -hmm. Lore time. The fallen leaves. <laughs> Tell a story. <sighs> See, nine. Not you want to explain this one. Unfortunately, Orion has learned that most of the base the templates of the endings start with that line, and it just annoys him at this point. I hate that one line. The and fallen leaves tell a story. Across the fog, the land. 
lands between. There's another line I'm sick of. Guess I keep hearing that in the endings too. Well, that's because at the at first you didn't mind a couple of spoilers here and there. You didn't plan on this ever happening. No, no, I didn't. Is nowhere to be found. I know where she is. And in the night of the black knives, Godwin the Golden was first to perish. We're gonna have to put a warning on the start of this one. Soon, Marika's offspring, demigods all, claimed the shards of the Elden Ring. What is the ring, exactly? Is it like a finger ring, or what's what's going on here? The taint of their newfound strength triggered the shattering. <clears throat> Bless You'll you. learn more about what the Elden Ring is as the story continues. A war from which no lord arose. A war leading to... Yep, there's one of the probably many I behemoths I will have to be fighting will. today. Well, not today, but coming up. Oh, rise now, ye tarnished. Ye dead, who yet live. The call of long lost grace speaks to us all. Horalu, the chieftain of the Badlands, the ever brilliant Gold Mask. Fear, the deathbed companion. The loathsome dung eater. Yeah. And Sir Gideon Othmir. The all-knowing. And the dead, apparently. Okay, is he done yelling at me? would again bless a tarnished of no renown oh so i'm i'm playing as a dead guy the fog to the lands between nice cape to stand before the elden ring And become the Elden Lord. Okay, that didn't tell me much except probably my list of targets. Oh, we're just straight in it. Okay. Uh, Get accustomed to your controls. R1 for light attacks. Okay, I found the dodge button. I you don't do that very well. Yes, yes I am. Also, anything that looks like a glowing blue flame is an item you can pick up. Yeah, your uh, R2 is a heavy attack, R1 is light attacks. How does someone die in here? Whatever he was, he really needed to use that thing on his back as a shield. That was a shield on his back. <laughs> Yeah, but he was not using it as a shield. There's an item over on your right. And I see it. Just hang on. I'm still getting used to this. What? What is? What is the square keep trying to do? Uh, assuming square is on your control buttons, it's on the left side. Yes. That would be the uh, item button, which you have none yet. And Y is doing what? Why is your interact button? Well, I'm gonna oh, you have parry on that shield. Very nice. Cannot be used to destroy chairs. Noted. 
No, it is parry. It is meant to block and counter attack. You are fat rolling, which means your character is over his weight limit. I didn't do anything yet! <laughs> this is what you get for starting with some of the strongest starting armor. Ways of it. But thankfully, you have a shield. Yeah, okay. Oh, well, keep I... going. Out the door. Hang on. How did this guy die in the starting room? It worries me a little bit that that guy was wearing what I was wearing, and they all seem to die in this one. How many people died here? <laughs> Why did so many people die here? This is just like I understand. Like each, like each of the circles is someone else who bought it. Like this, like this one over here is another guy. But like, how okay, many then. of you just stood here and croaked? A lot of them are wearing some endgame builds, so a lot of these guys are probably came back with a friend, summoned a cooperator, and then got invaded. You mean what I was thinking about doing with you? Uh, let's maybe let's... Part. maybe let's not. Not here. Not Go anywhere near here. This is where yeah. everyone's kicking off. Don't worry, you won't be here for long. <laughs> Am I about to die? I don't want to read these notes. Because I know the type of notes y'all are leaving behind. Necessary item ahead, therefore jumping off required ahead. That is a lie. <laughs> <laughs> I will tell you that now. Light ahead. First off, good luck! <laughs> you, can, you can thumbs up someone's message if you like it, by the way. How did you die? Don't tell me you jumped. I just saw a naked man run by with a club. Yeah, that's someone who's a wretch class. Okay. Oh, I don't trust this bridge. I don't do heights. This is not my song. Oh, don't worry. It's on the other side of the bridge through the big doorway. That's your first problem. <laughs> if, if, if this were any more obvious... <laughs> like the wind rushing through the way... The friggin' huge door too big for any human being. Uh-oh. You won't um, get there. You won't make it to that door. Oh, what is that? And what is my lock-on button? Uh, click the right stick. You'll forgive me if I try anyway. Absolutely. Go for it. Okay, okay, hold on, hold on a minute. Well, at least the fat roll is still a roll. Meet the grafted scion enemy. And there's no way to beat this guy. Oh, you still can. In fact, if you do beat him, you get a pretty good item. Did I just die? You died. Dang it. <clears throat> Am I supposed to be seeing something? Nope. Judging by the sounds, he just threw me off into the ocean. Yep. Dang it. <laughs> well, uh, if that's not Can an I indicator about how this is going to go. Can I tell you one piece of good news, though? Uh? There is a chance in later game you can actually come back here later and seek your revenge. <laughs> that will probably be on the shopping list. Step one added to shopping list. Get revenge on asshole. <laughs> Tell me I'm wrong. You're not wrong. Of course, how... I, I want to know. How what? many of y'all put that on your shopping list? There's a horse here, and he's glowing orange. That is not a horse. It has horns. What the heck is that? It is a horse. Why does it have Spirit horns? Worry, Torrent. Fortune is on his side. No, it isn't. Otherwise, I wouldn't have lost. Found him here, after all. One of his kind is sure to seek the Elden Ring. And then I pass out again. <laughs> Even if it does violate 
The Golden Order. The what? The Golden Order. The what? You'll learn more about them later. Okay, we need to go over a rule here. Like, if I ask a question and I'm not getting an explanation, please enlighten me. If not, then obviously. The Golden Order will be explained as you progress through the game. If you want me to explain it, we'll be here for the next two hours. I mean, how long am I going to be here in the first place? Gee, I wonder what I'm supposed to go towards. Not that. You now have a flask of Crimson Tears and a flask of Cerulean Tears. Those are your health and mana potions. They are now equipped to your X. Hitting down on the D-pad will swap out which one you currently have using. So if I hit the... what it, what, would, what would be the square button? Yep, you will heal yourself, but you don't need it because you're back at full health. Well, yes, you want to go more. jump down that cliffside to your right. Jump down the hole, you'll find the Cave of Knowledge. Oh, so I am actually supposed to jump in the hole. This one here, yes. That is the tutorial hole. That will take you to the tutorial. God dang it, people. That's the kind of message I was worried about. Won't this glankle me? You'd be surprised. When they add ledges. Ow. I'm still just, again, I'm still just trying to get used to all this. Oh, don't worry. It, every button is about to be explained to you. Okay. Ah, the grace. Sites of grace. Restore HP, F FP? Mm-hmm. Is that the mana? Yep. It also refill the flask. However, most enemies you've defeated will be... <laughs> I want to sit. No, I don't. Now I want to sit. Past time, flask, memorize, spell, short chest. And... Okay, well, I don't have a chest to sort right now, so I'm just going to move on. Nope, I'm not reading any more of your messages, y'all. Y'all leaving some weird things here. Uh, I take it I'm supposed to murder this guy. Yep, right-click target. Now, if you hold right bump, if you hold L R one and triangle, you can two-hand your weapon. Actually, if you hold triangle, uh, triangle and R one, and if you hold triangle and tap R one, you'll two-hand your current weapon. Ah. So that's uh, like a mode change. Yep. That's supposed to be that easy. He's your first enemy in the act. He's your first real enemy, so yes. <laughs> and someone still lost the fight to him. <laughs> Do I dare? <laughs> oh, there's another enemy. You literally had to be standing there doing nothing if that's how much health that guy's doing. I'm sorry, but whoever this is, you, you, I thought I needed practice. Wait a minute, that's like a bright freaking neon red. How many people, they had to have done that on purpose. That's more than one person. Strong attacks is your R2. I'm sure you knew this though. Yes, you mentioned that part. Guarding, yes, I know. I heard that. Yep, I'm still fat dodging, though. I guess I gotta work on the timing, then. Now, if you don't want to fat dodge, can I make a suggestion? Hit your uh, start button. Go to equipment. Remove some... Welcome to your equipment menu. I'd suggest removing the halberd. Hit X... Or hit your uh, square... Your X button... Whatever the equivalent on X is PlayStation. Yeah. And yeah, now you're back to a medium load, which means you can no longer fat roll. Oh, that's that's much smoother and faster. The halberd there is a second option. It's a stronger two-handed weapon than your sword, but your sword also lets you carry your shield. Yeah, I, I want the shield. Hey! Did I push the wrong button? Through. No, you just gotta run through him. Run past and under him. Like this? No, you went the wrong way. 
No, I mean, like, is this how you're supposed... Is this the dash it was referring to? Because I yeah, tapped in the, the left button. button. You hold the button you'd use for rolling to run faster. Okay, see, that, that part... Really? That part's on me, because it said L, so I thought push in the L. Serpentine. Serpentine. How? Serpentine. Serpentine. Oh. An actual enemy. Soldier of Godric. Switch right but hand, not switch the soldier hand. of Godric. Keep your shield up. He's waiting for you to make the first move. <laughs> well, uh, in with a strong attack. Oh. Oh. I didn't mean to do that. I'm very sorry. <laughs> what you did was called a stance break. You, if you wear down someone's endurance enough, they can't use their shield to block and you'll break their stance. That's what that breaking sound was. If their stance broken, if you go in close to them in front or behind them while their stance broken, you can do a critical, which is what you just did. This game is giving you a very false sense of invincibility here. Ow! Oh, it's you again. Yeah, revenge time. Go ahead, shoot me again. No, don't fall. <laughs> I normally wouldn't do that, but after, like, the pummeling you gave me from shooting me like that... Armaments all have... What? L Some weapons... Yep. Is that L1 Left or L2? Trigger. Left trigger is L2. Oh, so that's so just So when he tries to slack at you, you can parry. Um... I take it it's a very delicate timing on that? For parries, yes. Of course it is. Also, you're about half health. You can drink a flask if you want. You can crouch by clicking the left trigger, and you can sneak up, and you can crit him from behind if you can sneak up behind him. If you sneak up behind him and tap your R1... Yeah. Now, be honest. Did you manage to pull that off? My first time, no. Because I had no idea what I was doing. Oof! God, it's so freaking brutal, even for a Souls game. Oh, wait, hold, char charge attack. What? Okay, I yeah, knew about the, the jump you attack. The hold the right trigger, the more damage you'll do. Okay, well, I want to try that parry thing, so give me a minute here. Did it Did it work? No. I don't think it worked. I'm going to try one more time. Dang it! God, it's like, you expect it immediately. Did that one work? No, nope, because he would have staggered back. Oh my god, I suck at this. Keep your shield up. Does Is that part of it? I didn't even nope. hit the button. I'm gonna get this eventually. This is not working. Your 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 timing of your shield hitting his sword has to be the exact same time. Oh, forget it. I'll try it again later. Steak America. Uh. I mean, I'd rather do this than walk. Do I have to trigger this, or is it just here? No, it's already active. Oh, no. Your first actual boss of the tutorial. And I have nothing, and I'm already two health potions out. <laughs> How many people died in here? It's Soldier Godric, man. Careful, uh -oh. he's got a two-hander. Oh. 
Oh, oh like that? That was smooth. One of the hardest bosses in the game, hell. That was not the hardest boss. One of them. Because he's so new, you barely have a grasp of your controls at this time. And he hits hard. Thankfully, you've got some decent armor already. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Guys, I, I'm, I'm a little worried about y'all. And that's coming keep, from me. Keep in mind, most of them were mages and don't have your armor strength, okay? I guess. So, again, for starting the game off, I chose relatively easy mode here. You're going the wrong way, I think. I don't know where I'm going. Is that the Stake America in there? Yeah, so I was yes. going the right way. Yeah, so you were going the right way. Dang it. Hey, I get lost in here sometimes, too. Can't blame a guy for trying. Nope. You'd, you'd be surprised. Yeah, I know. I, 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 I will come in use later. I have heard so many people make fun of, like, bashing walls just for fun. It's like, it never paid off so much. And see, there's that doorway, and there's the pit you fell down. And, and if you go up there, there's an item there for you. Oh, I thought it was... How you people died here, I don't... Oh, you must have fallen directly off the cliff back into the hole like an idiot. Grab the item and let's get going. Yeah, 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 that's what I thought. <laughs> <laughs> Hang on. Hang on, I need to... Are these all you idiots falling into the hole? <laughs> <laughs> falling into the hole. Are you joking? <laughs> Where'd my teammate go? Pretty sure he fell in the hole. In the hole. <laughs> Let me guess. In the hole. Please say yes. Oh my god. <laughs> How do you leave a message? I'm gonna leave hole. Okay, hit start. <laughs> start, go to message, multiple messages. Yeah, write a message. Please tell me there's a hole option. Hole. <laughs> Done. Templates. No, no, you have to do a template. Be wary of hole. <laughs> <laughs> Is that actually... <laughs> there you go. I will save so many people's lives because of that one message. <laughs> go grab your f***ing item and get out of here. <laughs> Dude, you can't even be mad at me, okay? You like... have the emote strength. Oh, my God. Just make sure I'm not gonna fall prey. Uh, now what's up? Stairs and out you go. There's nothing to do with this obviously glowing tree. Nope. Just a light source. Just a light source. Oh my god, dude, the hole. <laughs> in the there's hole. Your, there's your hardest boss in the game. The only one you can't kill. The hole. The <laughs> hole. Uh. Did you never stop to check those stains on your replays? No. <laughs> oh, sight of grace. Thank God. You cannot get through that mist door. Refill your flasks. I can't go through here? Nope, because there's an imp statue beside it that says you need two st stone sword keys to open those mist walls. Drat. My usual tactic doesn't work. Item. On a corpse. Tarnish rolled finger to write the golden gun. Oh, so now I can call people. Yep. And by that I mean you. You also got a finger severer. Yeah. Which allows you to cease all multiplayer. I will avoid doing that for now. Because, <laughs> again, I just started. I don't want to die. Okay, am I just breaking things for the sake of breaking things, or is there actually, yes. like, a Zelda element to this? No, you're breaking things at this point to break things. Dang it. Ah! Get! <laughs> I did not know that was gonna happen. So when There's is a it going lever nearby. In case this type of left. crap... In case yes. this type of crap happens... Uh, you pull the lever to... <laughs> you have to stand on the other side and then pull it your direction. 
Pull the lever, Gronk. <laughs> Freak you, dude. I hate that I laughed at that. Yes, thank you. Seven appraisals. Get off the button so we can come back up. No, you gotta walk off the button real quick. There you go. Don't stand back on the button. <laughs> you will go back down. Well, I saw there was a lever that time, so... Nyeh. Yeah, no, still breaking things for breaking things. You just said that there was no harm in checking the walls. Welcome to Limgrave. You've Jeez. entered the actual world of Elden Ring now. Somebody way... Whoever did the visuals needs a race. <laughs> Is that a bird? That bird. There's an NPC back there, though, that wants to talk to you. Can I kill the bird? Uh, if you can, good luck. It's not going to kill you, it just it fly away. You're going to have to jump on the rock, which is why it's going to fly away. Oh. Go get it. Get the bird. Hit the bird. Frick off! Ah, dang it! Yeah, I tried. <laughs> now I back was, there, was... you'll see a man. As you come down from the main stairs, you'll see a man standing over there. Oh, is this the guy who started the meme? You are maidenless. <laughs> yeah, that's him. Oh yes, tarnished Darwin. Come. What is that that I'm staring directly at? Down the hill, a tree sentinel, one of the most heavily armored units in the game. Oh good. for you, however, you are maidenless. And there's the joke. Guidance, without the strength of runes, and without an invitation to the round table hold. You are fated, it seems, to die in obscurity. Activate the side of grace next to you and begin your actual adventure. On it, I'm gonna be level. I didn't even know that was there. Now the sights of grace will point you in directions to continue the story, the main storyline. So it's pointing me at that tower. That church. Yes, that is a church where is a good place to go next. Alright, well, we're gonna take a little break here, cause well, we've been at this for a bit for a minute. I just finished the tutorial. I take it the hand holding is done. I die from this point out, I die. You die from now, you die. Okay. So we're just gonna cut this episode here. We're gonna give it a little minute, so thank you all so much for joining me. Have yourselves a fantastic night. Take care and God bless.